Hey guys, Texas Coin Hunter here, and today we picked up two boxes of nickels uh, from the bank. We're going to open them up right now, make sure that they in fact are circulated. And these are circulated. And I'm sure these are as well. And they are. So we are searching for any more nickels, any uh, buffaloes, any errors varieties, and uh, anything else that'll help fill our albums. Um, we will bring you back with the first find. Okay guys, first find of the box, we've got ourselves a 1948 Denver. That's first find of the box. Let's keep going. Okay guys, this is still roll, this is still the same roll. 1940 Denver that is our second find of the box let's keep going okay this is roll 8 and we've got 1951 Philadelphia that is our third find of the box we've also found well that's our third find but we have found three absolutely stunning 1972 nickels so far. Uh, hopefully we find some more because those are some really good nickels. That is our third find of the box. Let's keep going. Okay, this is roll 10. And we've got a 1953 Denver. That is our fourth find of the box. Let's keep going. Okay, this is roll 11, and we found ourselves a buffalo. Hopefully it's got a date. It does not. I'll put it under a scope. And let's see if we can figure anything out. Okay, looking under the scope here, this looks like a 2, and this looks like an 8. So we're going to say this is a 1928 buffalo. I don't really want to nicodate it. So I think looking at it after a few minutes, I think that's what we've come up with. And it is a Philadelphia. There is no mint mark on the back. So we're going to say a 1928 Philadelphia. Let's keep looking. Okay, this is roll 17. And we've got a 1939 Philadelphia. That is our oldest find of this box. And one behind that one is a 1947 and that's a 47 Philadelphia. Let's keep looking. Okay, same roll and we've that's our third of this roll. We've got a 1958 and probably a Denver. Yep, 1958 Denver. That is our eighth find of the box. Let's keep going. Okay, this is roll 19. And we've got a 1946 Philadelphia. That is our ninth find of the box. Let's keep going. Okay, this is roll 22. And we've got a 19... 57 Denver that is our 10th find in the box let's keep going okay this is roll 27 and we've got a 1952 Philadelphia that is our 11th find in the box let's keep going okay same roll and we've got a 1941 Philadelphia. That is our 12th find in a box. Let's keep going. Okay, two nickels later. And we've got our third, third find in this roll. That is a 1939. 39 Philadelphia. That is our 13th find of the box. I'll bring it back if we find anything else. Okay, this is roll 36. 
and we've got a 1949 that looks like a Denver that is 14th find of the box and if you can see this right behind it I don't even know what this is Elizabeth the second it is 20 pence it is 2000 20 pence Elizabeth the second let me see if I can figure out where it's from I have no idea. I'll have to try and look that up, but that is our first foreign find of the box. Let's let's keep going. Okay, this is roll 39, and we've got an ender. Not this one. That one. Looks like we're losing four cents in this roll. I'll bring you back if we find anything. Okay, guys, so that's the end of box one. We found... Uh, 14 nickels from 1939 to 1959. Uh, we did find a buffalo. That was a 28, I believe. And we did find this 20 pence. Along with um, about 12 to 15 BU uh, coins from the um, early 70s to the uh, early 80s. I will show you those uh, at the end of the recap after our second box. Uh, let's start getting into that second box. See if we can find any more finds, including some more buffaloes and maybe some silver. I'll bring you back if we find anything. Okay, this is roll nine of box two. And we've got ourselves our first find. A 1959 Denver. That's our first find of the box. Let's keep going. Okay, a few coins later, same roll. We've got a 1941 Philadelphia. That is our second find of the box. Still roll nine. Let's keep going. Okay, this is roll 14, and we have back-to-back -back finds. Right here is a 1941 Philadelphia, and then right behind it, is a 1959 Denver that's finds three and four of the box let's keep looking okay this is roll 15 I was opening it up and I saw a reeded edge and I don't actually know what this is it is Jamaica that's a Jamaican five dollar coin from 1996 I don't know what that translates to American but I'm sure it's more than a nickel so that's our first foreign of this box it is our fourth I'm sorry our, yeah, our fifth find of the box let's keep looking just thought you'd like to know that that $5 Jamaican coin is worth about $0.03 cents American. So I ended up losing money on that one. Oh well, what are you going to do? Let's keep hunting. Okay, this is roll 18. And we have a buffalo. It does have a date. It's a 1928. And it does have a mint mark, but I can't see what it is. Let me see if I can pull up, pull up the phone here. It is a 1928... That's a 1928S. That is a 1928 San Francisco. Very good. That is cool. That is our sixth find of the box. Our first buffalo of this box. 
let's keep looking. Okay, this is roll 30, and we've got a 1956 Philadelphia. That is our sixth find of the box. It's been kind of slow so far. Let's keep going. Okay, roll 34, and we've got ourselves a 1957 Denver. That is our seventh find of the box. Let's keep going. Okay, this is roll 39, and we've got a 1947, and I believe that's a Denver. 1947 Denver, that is our eighth find of the box. Let's keep going. Okay, same roll, and we've got a really nice look in 1956. That's in really nice shape. To 1956, and that is a Denver. I'm going to scope it because I'd like to see if it has full steps. It probably doesn't, but you always got to take a look at it. That's our ninth find of the box. Let's keep going. Okay, this is roll 42. And we've got a 1951 Philadelphia. That is our 10th find of this box. Eight rolls to go. Let's keep going. Okay, roll 48. And I almost missed this because it isn't a normal greenish type color that silver nickels are. But this is a D mint mark. It is a 1944 Denver. That is our first worn nickel. It is the 11th find of the box. Uh, let's keep going. Okay, this is row 49, and we have back-to-back -back finds. We've got this 1955. And, of course, that's a Denver mint mark. And then right behind it was a 1957. And that also is a Denver Mint Mark. So that is finds 12 and 13 of the box. We've got one roll to go. Okay, this is roll 50 and we've got a 1957 Denver. That is the 14th find of the box. Let's see if we can find anything else. If not, I'll be back with a wrap-up. Okay, same roll. We've got a 1942, and it's not silver. It's not silver. It's a Philadelphia. Okay, let's just go through the rest of this roll, and I'll bring you back with a wrap-up. Okay, and that's a wrap for box two. We ended up getting 15 finds in box two, including the uh, 44 War Nickel and the 28S Buffalo Nickel. Okay, let's uh, do a total wrap up for everything and then we'll um, take a look at the book, see if we have any fillers, upgrades, anything like that. I'll bring it back. Okay, and that's a wrap. Uh, so for the two boxes, we ended up getting a total of 31 coins. Uh, we got two 39s, 40, three 41s, uh, 42, 46, two 47s, uh, 48, 49, two 51s, 52, 53, 55, three 56, four 57s, two 59s. We're going to be getting two 28 Buffaloes, one Philadelphia with very, very light date, and uh, the other 28 was a San Francisco. Uh, ended up getting one worn nickel in 1944. We got two foreigns. And then down here are some really nice uh, nickels. We've got five 1972s. Looks like they all came out of a BU roll or something like that. Also had a, a 71 and a 74 and a couple of 78s that look really nice. Uh, so now what we're going to do is we're going to see if we have any upgrades or fillers in the book. And we'll bring you back. Okay guys, we did have a couple of fills and a bunch of upgrades. Uh, we did upgrade the 1940 uh, D. 
Uh, we did need the 44D silver. Uh, we upgraded a bunch in the 70s. Uh, the 71. The 72, which is a really nice coin. Also the 74. And the 78. And we finally found... In 1988 Philadelphia you can see we're missing all these Phillies in the back of the book here so uh, yeah we're getting there I mean it's still a long way to go we still haven't really found any um, key dates or anything like that but you know we're getting there I mean this is uh, episode 9 or 10 I'm not really sure I think it's episode 10 it, it is episode 10 um, but we've got a long way to go. Uh, hopefully, uh, you know, along the way, as we're finding more, we can find some more upgrades. Um, and, you know, maybe find some more buffaloes and silvers. Uh, some silvers that we actually do need. Um, we actually only need one, two. We actually only need five of the silver ones right now. So, uh, hopefully we find any silvers, we can upgrade them. Hopefully you like what you saw. Uh, give us a thumbs up, hit subscribe, ring that bell for notifications. Uh, like and share the video and until next time we'll be seeing you thanks for watching